I felt different, frustrated, and shy when I found out I was hearing impaired at such a young age. Here is Mary Lou Beale speaking through her interpreter. I lost my hearing when I was two years old from the result of a high fever and an ear infection. My life changed after I found out I had this disability. Mary Lou Beale, a hearing impaired American Sign Language teacher at St. Francis School, inspires her students that ASL can be easily understood. I had many obstacles to overcome until my two sisters taught me sign language. My two sisters and I honor, understand, and love each other better because we have a fun time communicating. My husband is deaf, so we communicate through sign language. I am disappointed that my two oldest sons do not communicate with me through sign language. However, Raina and Riley, my two youngest children, are able to communicate with me through sign language every day. My youngest daughter, Raina, is very fluent at sign language. I overcame obstacles to become more passionate towards sign language and to communicate with people. I love to teach hearing people sign language because they can communicate with me. With American Sign Language not offered in many schools as a foreign language, Mary Lou Beale strives to teach younger generations to communicate and bring more awareness about the deaf community. About 13 years ago, I started to work with Beth King, a teacher at Wailuku Elementary School for the deaf program. It changed my life when I started teaching sign language three and a half years ago. It was very different and it kept me stable. I realize I enjoy working with deaf children. It makes me feel great when teaching hearing impaired children to sign and this teaching opportunity has changed my life. There are a lot of events I attend such as ASL socials at Starbucks, deaf community events, deaf happy hour, ASL hike, and the list goes on. My passion is to educate and inspire students to communicate through sign language. It can be easily understood through the wonderful use of hands. I truly care about teaching ASL from hearing impaired people to any group of age. By having students to participate in deaf social events, they become part of the deaf community ohana in the future. Mary Lou Beale continues to pursue her passion by teaching sign language to her high school students at St. Francis School. In the future, she likes to see sign language taught in other schools just like other foreign language classes. This is Minji Kim from St. Francis School for Hiki No.